Hi guys, it's Nicole here and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to take a trip down memory lane and give ourselves a little 2011 makeover because it's been exactly 10, 10, it's been exactly 10 years since then. Okay, so uh, here's some of my reference material. That is what I'm going off of. I was ninth grade, kind of teeter-tottering between wannabe emo and wannabe indie, but my mom wouldn't let me dye my hair then, so it's just some very sad mixture of the two. We wore a lot of eyeliner. Lots of eyeliner. I don't have gel eyeliner anymore, so I'm going to attempt to hit my waterline with uh, that one right there. We have the eyeshadow applicator. The one from the year 2011. <sighs> Shit, okay. Where's a mirror? When you improvise like I do, you use the camera itself as a mirror. It is one of my many talents. We have what I've attempted a waterline. Next, we do the wing, but it's also with like crappy gel liner. We need like a nice thick wing. Uh, would you be mad if I told you that I'm not actually that impressive and I did stop the camera to do my eyeliner in a mirror? I'm sorry, I know. Mascara to really blacken the blacks of my face. My eyes, I mean, I look scary. What indie bands were popular? The Kooks, All American Rejects, probably. The only appropriate thing to do next would be to put some eyeshadow on top. I'm pretty sure this eyeshadow has been in my makeup bag since 2011. No, God, please, no! Okay, so I would put it on my finger and just tap. Don't put on eyeshadow that is most likely 10 years old. I think that's probably a bad idea. Okay, so now it is time to at least start parting my hair in the side swept bang, the side swoop, the emo. There was no way that you would ever catch me looking like this. No, no. I put my hair way, way over here. Oh, this looks so weird. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> of course, your look is not complete without the iconic Neff beanie. You have to make sure that you can see Neff or else people will think that you're a poser. Got it? Got it? Oh, I'm already cringing at the fact that this is happening. Am I suddenly realizing how stupid this actually looks? I think I am. But you know what I just realized? The thing that was very popular back then was in fact the hippie headband. Let me give you an example. <laughs> Put a rubber band around our heads and did this. Am I? Oh, <laughs> am I look? Uh, yeah. <laughs> no. It's not complete without your nerd glasses. We're not even done yet. As most of you who were middle schoolers or high schoolers in 2011 can guess, I am doing that. The mustache on the finger. It was a staple. Staple. For obvious reasons, I only recorded the finished product of this part, but basically I got dressed in the classic 2011 attire, which is very, very skinny jeans, a loose fitting top, and flats. We're almost there, but I'm not done yet. The time has come to straighten my hair. So now I will finally straighten my hair. The moment we've all been waiting for, I just know it. It's like muscle memory, you know. 
I'm going to save you guys the trouble of listening to me nostalgically ramble about straightening my hair as if I haven't done it in a while, which just isn't true, but somehow my weird quarantine mind thought that it would be funny and relatable. Oh my god. I did it. I did it. I did it. I look, I am a 2011 goddess. This is so, oh, I feel like I've gone back in time. This is very strange. What should I do? I should sing a song. Oh my God, I should play something on the ukulele. For my fans, fans? Ew, that sounds so pretentious. For the people who have been watching for like 10 years, cause I just realized that I've been doing this for 10 years, this YouTube channel. And it once was with this ukulele that I got for Christmas in 2011. Wait, 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 how do I? Oh, what the heck? How do I, what do I, what am I saying? What am I doing? I know how to play the ukulele still, I swear. I don't know. Man, life was so interesting in 2011. Like we were all worried that the world was gonna end in 2012 and honestly, I kind of wish it did because then we wouldn't have had to deal with uh, the past 365 days. I can still do the hair flip too. <laughs> this makes me want to watch Twilight. Yeah, that's what I wanna be doing right now. I am going to go. I don't know if this is going to be posted, but if it is, it means that I did something interesting with it. So I hope you at least enjoyed what I had to offer today, which is some nostalgia. Some great, yummy nostalgia. Okay? Okay.